What's up guys? Heading out a little bit. I thought I would maybe, out of boringness, do a little flip through. This crate that I keep around that pretty much houses new records that come in and records that I uh, had listened to and felt could use a cleaning. And even I have some records towards the back that I've been sitting in here for months that I needed, you know, really attend to and maybe file away finally. Uh, yesterday I picked up four releases locally on the FMP label. These ones that have been sitting around going back to last spring. A collection had come in and I picked up a bunch of some free improv, free jazz uh, stuff from that collection. And there were so many FMP releases, or FMP releases that were included. And I kind of had the hunch or had a hunch that they weren't going to sell so I can probably let them sit for a bit and I did and luckily you know after maybe about five months of since I'd been or uh, last visited I went back and four of them were still there including this one Globe Unity Special another Globe Unity Special into the valley the one that I really wanted to be here or be there Kung Boar Schlippenbach and Johansson do enjoy that artwork and uh, another Globe Unity with pearls and guests this one Anthony Braxton Enrico Rava Manfred Schuf, Schuf who I believe had the very first FMP release uh, another record fair recently um this one local, I had picked up uh, two LPs, and this was one of them. My very first that I had found in person on the Museum Collection Berlin West label. I guess very um, similar label to maybe the UNESCO collection stuff on Philips and uh, Okora. But this one on Angola, look at that cover. Ritual music for solo voice. Male and female choruses and large percussion ensembles. I don't think I've spun this one yet, but uh, I can already tell I'm gonna enjoy it. It's been um, a year of collecting Drove Van Drugenbrook stuff, mostly on the Color Sound Library. This one was reissued a couple years ago, or reissued or released a couple years ago, this Drum Circus album. It's a very, pretty jazzy affair. I'll show you who makes appearances. Pete Geiger, you know, pretty well-known German percussionist, Ben Drugenbrook, Gerd Dudek is on here. Don't know some of these other players. I do know that Carol Muriel is, she was the vocalist on those Brain Ticket albums. But this is great and cheap. Uh, none such, you know, these are all pretty much terrific. I had not picked up anything, uh, Middle Eastern or, you know, from that region. I saw this one on this Iranian one, had to have it. Uh, during the, um, well, at the same shop as the none such I just showed, I picked up this McCoy Tyner Sahara, this Japanese repress, great album. Bought this Buddhist meditation album on BASF and Harmonia Mundi, uh, mostly for the involvement in Peter Michael Hamill, uh, Between and his solo albums that I've talked about before. I still have to dive into the rest of this. I listened to the first side of the, the second LP. It's, this is two LPs. Peter Michael Hamill, um, voice and organ. Voice and keyboard, and Anatole Arcus synthesizer drone. This is a good meditative piece. This got repressed, luckily, and I snatched it up finally. Um, Bent Nordstrom, you know, one of the greatest uh, Swedish jazz musicians of all time. Produced Albert Aller's first record. Uh, 
still have to go through this entire box that I listened to one of the sides on uh, maybe his natural history elements included here. It's great saxophone work. Music Electronica Viva. This was unreleased up until maybe a couple years ago of a 1967 performance. Got two Francois Tusk uh, piano albums. I think these were about 10 bucks each. Uh, marked down at Dusty Groove last spring. This is a post Anexus Qualm album. I don't think all members are on this, but at least one is along with various others, uh, improvisational album. I have to spin this a few more times. Not sure where it lands with me. There are some good moments, but um, with some improvised music, you can go in the wrong direction. Van Drugenbrook's Color Sound Library soundtrack. This one for Southeast Asia. I had added this uh, Rodelius 80s release, Wheatsland. This is the Bureau B reissue. I'd been holding out for an original. Just very hard to come by at a good price. Pekka Eriksson in. Um, free improv, jazz, you know, maybe even psychedelic rock ish musician out of Finland. Ben Sperm and part of the Samza Trio. That Samza Trio record is very hard to come by. I think the Berm just might have had a, a many an anniversary release of a of that album on a different box set. This one is Vinyl on Demand, covers material from '68 to '76. Great electroacoustic work out of Peru, Toro Ruiz del Pozo, made of Peruvian instruments and magnetophonic tape from 1978. Another ethnographic album out of Bali. Still have to spin this. Great Folkways release, Music of Afghanistan. Josie de Oliveira had missed out when this was released a couple years ago. Um, prices had sort of risen on this. Found one for a good deal. Still have to spin it. Um, when I picked up the, uh, the Tyner and that Iranian None such. I'd also picked up this Afghanistan music from the crossroads. Another None Such Explorer series release. Uh, Makita Carroll. This is the uh, the special artwork release on Souffle Continu. Orange Fish Tears. Would love an original of this album. This is tremendous. Lloyd Miller at the ends of the world. I've had this sitting around for months. Still in this crate. Picked up the Pharaoh Sanders box set that was released a couple months back. Again, tremendous package. Uh, the Wu release, I think going back to last spring, maybe late winter. This is in here because, uh, well, I thought I needed a cleaning. This is the reissue that came out a couple, couple years ago. Same deal, needs a cleaning. I had pulled this here in Dillaway's. Sounds of the Indian Snake Charmer. Andrew Lyles. Um, Anal Aura Gram Gramophone. Comes with a 7 inch. I believe Stunty has played this, maybe you've mentioned it before. Nurse with Wound Spiral Insana. Uh, a seller had mailed me the wrong the wrong album and this was the one that they'd given me. I already have a copy of this so I'll probably be selling it. Uh, dead stock copies of these I think still exist. Dwight James and her heat. Quentin Rollet, Terry Mueller on the body on your body's landscape, saxophone and electronic music. Faust 10 inch I'd picked up. Going back to last spring I still need to play. Don Cherry Dollar brand release from last year. Chris Cole suggestion from the UNESCO collection. Turkish release, awesome stuff. John Carter Fields, Zawinal, good album, cheap. Dollar brand's The Journey.
Music of the Desert Road. This is a mono pressing, Devin Bachara. Awesome stuff on Angel Records. It's David Berman release. I had just picked up on Lovely from um, uh, the record fair a couple weeks back. Doesn't look cool, but this is uh, a pretty decent album featuring Don Cherry. I had picked this uh, Don. It's uh, had it at um, Anger Mom. Needed a copy. He sent it my way. Walt Dickerson Sun Ra Visions. This has been sitting around in this crate. Probably should file this one away. Our Ensemble of Chicago. Great release. This is a maybe third, fourth pressing. Uh, Original pressing of this is an astronomically priced album. This is, I think, an 81 reissue. Cluster's first album together. Um, side one features some Germanic vocals. Don't know the language, but I know that it's probably terrible, but the second side is amazing. Some other records that have been sitting around here for a while. Drum Cooper, I know that this, there were Dead Sock copies probably still exist out there this is cheap this is good uh, this is a uh, dom had thrown this in i still need to listen to this dead seas michael marley gate and then i can't believe i mean when this was a record store day release going back to whenever record store day was last spring great album it's been sitting here for a while still need to play it all the way through and file it away all right Oh, there's music in the background. I'm playing two albums at once. Phil Nyblock's Jelly Plays Nyblock and Telec 2's Belzebu. Nice little drony work with uh, Telec 2's uh, synthesizers. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.